Hello everybody, and welcome back to a, another episode of Golden Sun with Mio X Fu. And you might notice that the graphics, actually you might not notice depending on, most of you probably don't full screen it. <laughs> I know I wouldn't. Um, <laughs> but the graphics look slightly different. A bit blockier you might say. Well, I realized I had a filter on. Who would have guessed? Not me, obvi obviously. Because it took me this long to figure it out. Um, I don't know if I just left it on from something else, or if it was set automatically, but it's off now. And that was probably why we had the frame stuttering early on. Oh yeah, and another thing. Ready? 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 Oh my god! Do you see what I'm seeing? No longer do we have the jittery ocean, or the jittery landscape all around. I mean, yeah, there's a few still minor flaws with it tracking, but oh my god! I can actually just sit here and not feel like someone's gonna get motion sick from this. That's fantastic. As is this music, oh my god. I feel like I should be doing a jig or something right now. I see, I can sneak around this way. So sneak we shall. Maybe we can climb up the cliff and go behind someone's house. Ooh, perhaps we actually might be able to do something like that. Well, first, we have to... Shoot. We have to throw a gin over at someone else, just like, chuck it at him. <laughs> Only it was sap. No, we'll have to chuck some flint at him. We can't chuck a sap at him. Thank God, too, he'd just be knocked out right cold. Freeze an ice pillar? I wonder what this'll... what this'll do. Well, we'll find out in a second, shan't we? Sh <laughs> shant. I never get to use that word. Oh, man, I love this music. This music is fantastic. I, I, I forgot all about it. What are you gonna tell me about that, uh, that music on the wind? <laughs> wow, she said the money was for both of us. What do you mean? Did your brother steal it from you? Wee, oui, it's a festival, it's a colossal festival. What'll I buy with all the money you mama gave me? I can't decide. You are a jerk, sir. I would take out my... my... my sword and thrash you hard with the pommel right now. I would take it... I would... no. Oh god, that sounds terrible. <laughs> I would, um... Tell your mother about the terrible things you're doing to your daughter right now if I wasn't in a hurry to get this Marge, Mars gin. Aw, oh, man. That's loud. <laughs> what did we get? We got the Mars gin ember. Ooh, this guy's actually really useful because... Yeah, he restores the party PP. We're gonna be using you quite a bit. We get anything new from that? No, unfortunate. We have enough. Do we have enough? I want cool things. No, not yet, I guess. Unless, wait a minute, is it this? Ugh, there's some way. I'm telling you guys, there's some way to get really cool classes using these djinn, but I can't figure it out. No, it's not Defender. It's not Defender. There's some way to do it, but I can't figure it out. All right, enough of that. Let's screw this up <laughs> again. Jeez. Uh, I cannot believe how bad I am with organizing these gin. I'll probably cut out some of this because this is boring to watch. Okay, good. Good enough. Let's go figure out what this place is all about. Ooh, this is a nice-looking fountain. Hmm, do you want to test your luck at the Toby Spring? Uh, I guess so. Really? Well then, I'll give you the chance to go first. Wait, what are you talking about? Face away from Toby Spring and toss a coin into it. If you get lucky, something good will happen. Ooh, if I get lucky. 
If you toss a lucky metal and get really lucky, you'll get a better prize than you would with a coin. Oh, cool. Tony's always bustling during Colossal. This festival only happens once a year, so I'm really excited. I'm excited too. Yeah, so excited. Whoa! Oh my God! It's bigger on the inside. <laughs> Toby Springs has mysterious powers! Stand with your back to the spring and throw a coin at the target. Um, wow, yeah, I, I would say it has mysterious powers. Somehow it has crabs and turtles in it. You have lucky metal. I do, sir. Oh, you do. How lucky! Ha 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 ha! So I'll be extra lucky if I toss that in instead. I see, sir. Too bad I only have one lucky metal. I'll take that off of you. Oh, you don't want to risk losing it. Damn. Damn, damn, damn. Alright, so anyway, this is Tolby Fountain. Well, before we throw lucky medals in, I'm gonna throw some coins because... Well, you'll see. Basically, what you want to do is you want to try to get them in the middle. Whoa! And try not to hit those guys. Because the more you hit them, the more they speed up. And the, well, they'll actually hit your coins. You can do really well and not hit a single one of them, almost, you will get in the center and then you'll get a huge prize. Um, yeah, you can get coins from this, but that's not really the point of this fountain. And it's really easy to screw up. A lot of t I've spent a lot of time at this fountain and a lot of times I've just gone out and come back in to reset them, just like, see, now they're all red again. And it's easier, because they're slower. And what I'm going to do... Save my game. Because we only have eight lucky medals. And I want to show you guys some of the awesome stuff we can get with those lucky medals. So... i wait for you, turtle, to get the hell out of the way. Get out the way, turtle! Get out the way! Oh! No! That's terrible! Anyway, we'll get a special prize from the Dragon Head, and we got... Battle Gloves! Actually, I wanted those, so we're gonna keep a hold on those. But, we can get much better things. If we're much- if we're a bit luckier. Just gotta wait for those turtles. Okay, it should be good. Oh no! Hit the crab, of course it hit the crab. Oh, we got in the middle though, that's all that matters. How? Lucky! <laughs> And we got spirit armor. This is what we're really going for. This spirit armor, I'll show you in just no, no, no. I'll show you in just a second. is pretty fantastic. All right. So first of all, let's give some battle gloves to Garrett. I mean, look at it. It raises his attack by three points. Who wouldn't want that? Actually, we're going to be giving them to. Yeah, you know, we're going to be giving them to Mia because she needs an attack boost. But, if we look at the spirit armor, it resists all elements. That's fantastic. And it's better than what Isaac and Garrett both have. So. Um. Well, we're gonna give it to Isaac first, because he has, well, less. Yeah, he has less defense right now, so we might as well. Uh, we should probably distribute those water of life at some point as well, so we don't have another almost catastrophe like we did on the ship over. Oh my god, I can't believe that I survived that. Like, we still haven't died, so you guys might not be... Oh, that's terrible. Fortunately, we get like, I think like 30... And we get a Psy a psy Crystal, which is still good. We get like 30 lucky medals throughout the, the course of the game, I think. So I'm not really concerned about losing this stuff, because it's not by any means the best armor or anything in the game. At all. And look, we got Guardian Armlet. That's, that's still good, and we didn't even get inside the ring. I, I actually don't know how... <laughs> I don't know how um, it actually works. I don't know if uh, it has to do with getting it inside the ring, or if it's just a random chance. I'm assuming it's a random chance plus getting inside the ring, because, I mean, we got... We've already gotten two different things for two different places in the ring. Or, for the for about the same place in the ring. Let's see what we get this time. 
Ooh! An Assassin Blade. That's actually really good. I forgot that we could get those here. That is going right to... We can either give it to Isaac, or we can give it to Ivan. And it's actually going to benefit Ivan a lot more right now than it is going to benefit Isaac. So we're going to give it to him. Actually, I'm going to save. Um... Yeah, by the way, I, I like to keep the Lighthouse Eerie um, saved, just because I maybe I want to go back and fight Saturos one day. Oh, shoot, I didn't mean to throw that. I thought it... Oh, that was terrible. Oh, but we got something out of it anyway. We got a kimono. Oh, yeah, Garrett's going to wear that kimono all night long. Actually, it won't. It's unisex. It just doesn't really tell us... Whether it's a man's kimono or a woman's kimono. Yeah, look, he doesn't even need that. Boost four, and it doesn't even boost as much agility as the elven, as the elven one. I think Garrett should get this one. So equip that Garrett. Of course, I don't know why it's giving you more de defense than your synergy armor, but whatever. Ah, no, you guys are all purple. You can. <laughs> I'm not gonna start you guys off. Right, and let's go for this. Oh no, it hit the crab! Whew! Oh! Oh, I thought I was gonna hit the turtle at the very last second, but I guess not. Anything good? Anything good? Oh! I want another Assassin's Blade. Those are really good. And we'll give Garrett a cocktail dress. Now that is not unisex, so I don't know what... <laughs> I don't know what Garrett's going after. See, it's useless to her, though. Well, it boosts PP, but she's got so much PP. Look at, look at, 113, and she's already down, like, 20 PP. Ah, uh, we better, might as well throw the lucky metal. Oh, god damn it! Oh, get in the center! Oh, yes! Come on, I need another, another Assassin's Blade. Just one more Assassin's Blade. Ah! Uh, I don't want Guardian Spirit Armor! <laughs> Uh, now what I could do is I could just restart my game and just go for all, all Assassin's Blade, but I'm not going to do that, because that's, that's, that's dumb. I'm going to keep what we got, and we're going to go sell it. Yes, this will be the shopping episode. Wow, that was a really sharp, uh, whistle that I had there. <laughs> Can someone live to be more than 100 years old? Nah, man. You could be right, but then what about Torby's leader, Bobby? He's supposedly at least 50 years older than I am. And let me tell you, Missy. Uh, I mean... Oh, you're a boy. I'm sorry, my eyesight hasn't been well in these past 50 years, because you see, I'm 150 already. <laughs> Rats, we overslept, and now the Coloss... The Col Colosseum. The Colosseum is full. There's nothing we can do, so we've just been wandering about around all the... Aww. We've missed Colosso? No way, man. Ooh. Do you have rarities? Yes, you do have Water of Life now. Good. So we might be buying that at some point. Uh, probably not right now because we don't have much gold to spare. Get rid of the Elven Rapier. We can always buy it back. Uh, we're gonna get rid of some Sleep Bombs because those are kind of useless right now. We'll get rid of the herbs, because we don't need those anymore, either. I mean, we'd be spending a turn to get back half a turn worth of damage. <laughs> it's completely useless. Uh, smoke bombs, those are still useful. Those, I remember having a pretty high percentage of actually working. So, we're gonna sell the Synergy Armor, too. Basically, the name of this game is sell everything, get as much as we can. <laughs> get rid of gauntlets. Because Tolby is the first place that we get to that has really, really good armor and weapons, if I remember correctly. Um, much better than what we've seen so far. So we'll get rid of the Adept's clothes, the armlet, and the robe. And again, we can always buy all this stuff back, so... 
if we find out, oh, well, I should have kept that cocktail dress. It might have been useful. Just go right, just go right back and get it. All right, so Elven Rapier, Bandit Sword, we don't care about that. Angelic Onk. I'm trying to remember if this is good. It's pretty good. Um, yeah, we should probably give that to Mia, but let's see what the War Mace does. Because, <laughs> su again, surprising, she can take a War Mace. And it's actually really good. But it does have Life Leech, so I think I'm going to take the Angelic Ankh over that for right now, just because, well, it's, it's really good. However... Oh man, great swords. Do we have enough? Yeah, we do. Alright, 204, I want to check the Great Axe. Yeah, great swords are going to be the best right now. And we're gonna need the we're trust me we're gonna need the the, the I almost said firepower but these are <laughs> gun swords <laughs> no we are definitely going to need the power uh oh we never really got to see the effect of Vulcan Axe did we that's too bad it's kind of cool but it's not as cool as things we're gonna be seeing later on so whatever all right rarities nothing good. God, you don't have any jewel bedazzle dresses or anything? Alright, this is what we're really here for. Armored shell is not going to be as good as anything else. Okay. Silver vest, not going to be as good as anything else. <laughs> Jerkin is actually pretty terrible. We could get that, like, the last town, couldn't we? Alright, so it looks like we're not actually going to be getting anything great. Now we could get the Guardian Circlet, but those are kind of expensive. So I'm not gonna. We get any coin? Come on. Nothing. Nothing to loot. Oh well. Oh man. Let's go check people's houses. I heard Babby is using the money he's made to build a lighthouse in Gondwin. Everyone calls it the Babby Lighthouse. Is it really small? It's a little babby lighthouse <laughs> ooh I see a secret oh my god how lucky we got a lucky medal maybe we will get that other assassin's blade forgot that there's a lot of them here looked in the oven he's boiling the pasta it looks like he's overcooking it oh god come on come on guy get that no no get get your pasta out of the oven it's gonna be all chewy and gross and ew I don't even want to think about that what? Damn it, I want mind read. You don't even have your pasta on your mind. God! You just take some more cut of the money we all earned. That's that's how to make money. Naming the lighthouse he built after himself is a little vain, don't you think? Oh, I thought it was just babby like it's a baby. <laughs> I've decided not to fight that colossal after all! Have you seen the contestants? They're huge! <laughs> I saw the people who were going to fight. They look so intimidating! Yeah, so that doesn't mean anything. We, we fought a Kraken on the way over here. We can fight huge guys. Jeez. We could have just gotten in the house. Uh, anything? Nothing. God. <laughs> oh, I want to see Colosso, but no one will take me. I'll take you, kid. I'll kidnap you. Of course he won't take you to Colosso just because you keep trying. It means you're a brat. I was stubborn. I said, I'm not going to see any of the tryouts, but now I wish I'd gone. Oh, <laughs> I really want to see Colosso too, but the Coliseum just gets too crowded. So I'm going to just watch the finals. Oh, that seems like a good idea. I mean, finals are the most exciting part. That's when you get to see the biggest and best warriors. I mean, I guess not everybody would really agree with me on that, but <laughs> sucks to be done. I think the the end of any competition is always the best part. Usually. Sometimes it's kind of dumb. But the crowds at the Coliseum made me feel sick, so I came back. Oh, what are you... got crowd sick? I couldn't sleep at all last night. The guy next to me snored the whole time. I'm so tired. I'm just not ready for Colossal. Oh man, I know what you feel like. That's how I was like last yesterday, you know? Got no sleep. 
Do you want to stay with us? Yeah. Actually, I'm sorry, but we're already full and I don't have room for you. Well, God, why'd you ask, jerk? It's too late to start looking now. They'll never find a place to stay. <laughs> Ooh, wait a minute. People fighting at Colossal all stay at Babby's Palace. Hmm, maybe we should fight in Colossal and get a place to stay. Toby is packed with tourists during Colossal, so the inns are all full. Me, I just line up some beds and... Presto, I'm an innkeeper. Raking all the moolah. Alright, so... That is our first taste of Tolby. We're going to be doing a lot more around here over the next few episodes, so sit tight. We are by no means done with this town. Look at all this stuff. We've only gone... Look at, look at. We're only halfway through the town. We've barely made a den. <laughs> we might not even get to Colosso next episode. But you know what? It's worth it. It's, this, this is probably the, one of the coolest towns. Just because of this... But also, because of, because of this little guy right here. And I think, isn't there something up here as well? I don't know, we'll find out, won't we? Next time on Let's Play Golden Sun with Mio Xfu. I'm stuck on a guy. There we go. <laughs> Take it easy, guys. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Colossal is held in the Coliseum in the heart of Tolui. If we don't go right now, we won't get good seats. That won't be any fun. I'll go with you. You look would have such pretty babies with uh, our corn blonde hair. Although you get to pay for dinner. Alright, <laughs> see you guys. <laughs>